Yes, family yangu ya YouTube. Welcome once again. Your mama is in the house. And you know, as always, we discuss what is trending and what is making news. You know, tumesema mara hii, tumechoka kuongelelea mambo ya watu. Tunataka kuongelelea mambo ya familia, mambo ya jamii, mambo ambayo. Unaka hivi chini and you're like, yeah, this is exactly what I need. Like, this is what I really need. Like, sisi tumechoka. Mi, kwanza mimi ni mechoka. Stories za kuenda kupigia, kupigia, pigia watu mapicha kuleta hapa. Ami, I'm tired. So, mi ni mefika mali ni mesema, let me just talk about things that make us who we are. Let us just talk reality stuff. Vitu za nyezikondani ya manyumba zetu. Sio huko kwa mabarabara, sio kwa majirani. Vitu za nyezikondani ya nyumba zetu. That is what we are talking about. So, as always, as always, we are looking at what is trending today. And what is trending today is none other than this statement. As always, you know, your mama always have to read somewhere. So, whatever is trending today is, a, even though inasemekana, okay? A good husband is not a man who is rich or handsome. A good husband is a man who respects and knows the value of a woman. What's that, Nerudia? A good husband is not a man who is rich or handsome. A good husband is a man who respects and knows the value of a woman. Yes, you as a, as a husband, ask yourself, do you really know the value of the woman you are having? At your home, like size, size, do you know? Do you, do you have an idea of the value your woman possesses? Your wife, okay? So we are talking about good husband. And kuna watu wa wanasema, oh, mimi na, if you want to find a good husband, let that husband be rich. That is very true. That is very true. That anyway, that is this is what is trending right now. We ladies, we are looking for rich men and handsome men. That is very, very true. Nani anataka kuzaa watoto wenye wanakaa surambaya? Kila mtu anataka kuzaa watoto wenye wakona suramzuri. Kila mtu anataka kuwa mwanaume mwenye ako na pesa. Mtu atanuliza na nyinyi wanawake. Wewe ngoja kwanza, ngoja hapo. Usinuliza maswali. Ngoja kwanza ni malize ndi utaniuliza. <laughs> so now the topic is all about does a good husband need to have riches? Does a good husband need to be a handsome man? But of course, but of course, who wants to get into poverty knowing very well this is the poverty life that I'm getting myself into? Mimi, ah, uh, mi apana. Tusemezane tu ukweli. Tuonge tu mambo ya ukweli. Hakuna mtu anataka kuoleka na mwanaume mwenye ni maskini. Mwanaume mwenye ni poverty that is surrounding that man. Ay, apana. We? Tuta, we? <laughs> Tutakula nini? Hmm? Tutakula nini? Wengine wetu tuko na maalsas, tusipokula tunaumwa na matumbo. We lazima ukwetu na pesa tafadhali. Hapo nayo, hii statement, by the way, hii statement, let me, let, me, let me read it again. A good husband is not a man who is rich. Eh? Hey. So people are discussing that a good, ma a good man is not a man who is rich. Wewe mimi na dispute your statement. A good man has to be rich. Oh. A good man has to be very rich. You know, when we talk about richness, it's not all about money, money, money. Wisdom wise, kuwa rich, uku kwa oblangata, kuwa na oblangata that is very rich. Yanyonezaka hivi and we're like, let us look for a business to do. Let us invest in this. You know, it's not all about rich. Unajua, when you talk about richness, somebody says, a chichi su unongele mambo ya pasa, we ngoja bwana, siyo mambo ya pesa kila wakati. Kuna wale watu wenye wako rich upstairs anaweza kukupea idea na wewe mwanamke unaweza manifest na ifanye mkuwe rich. Are you hearing me? Are you hearing me? Oh yes. That is where now a woman is supposed to come in. Hapo ndo mali unasikia watu wakisema um, behind behind is a successful man there is always you a woman. Yes. Wewe mwanamke Learn to manifest these things. Mze wako anakuletia idea. Kuwa chap chap kumanifest. Ia idea. Yenye mze ya mesema tuneza uza toothbrush. Eh? Tutafute soko ya toothbrush. Wewe ndio, wewe ndio utafanya mwanaume wako akui rich. Kimawazo. You manifest mawazo ya mze wako. Mbaka inaleta uzuri kwa ndoa. So, eh, a good man has to be rich. My friend. A good man has to be rich upstairs. Upstairs. Lazima tu kui rich. Let us not lie to each other. Let us not ah, let us not lie to each other. A good man has to be rich. Who could you? Who are too rich? Alafu let us talk about this handsomeness. 
<laughs> Let us talk about this handsomeness thing. Eh? Nilikuwa nimesema, nani mwenye anataka kuzaa watoto wenye wanajika? Eh? Wewe unazaa watoto wenye wanajika, alafu unenda kwa, 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 kwa ma Facebook, unenda uko kwa ma Instagram, unenda uko kwa ma TikTok, unenda uko sijuu wapi, uko kwa ma, ma sites. Tu hizo social media zenye manajua, unenda munatua picha za watoto wa wenye, wenye ni warembo, wenye ni wazuru, wameshuka tunyoletua, kwa za yangu imeparara leo. Wameshuka tunyoletua utu vizuru, unatu screenshot, unakuja unatuwekea, unatuwekea status. Why can't you screenshot your own children and put them on social platforms? Hapo ndio nimekuja kwa handsomeness. Kuna wamama hadi wa leo wanaenda wana screenshot watoto wa wenyewe, wanakuja wanawaweka kwa platforms zao. Mbona usi, mbona usikuwe proud of your own kid? So a good man has to be handsome. That one is a that one is a no discussion. Let us not discuss. <laughs> Let us not discuss about that. A good a good a good man has to be handsome. That is all. Mambo ya ugliness sisi tulitoka huko kitambo 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 hizo ni za mababu zetu ya kwamba bora tu umeoleka umepata boma yako you are good to go eh hey, hey, hey. saizi hapana you have to be for you to be a good man you have to be handsome mm. nani wanataka kutembea na mwanaume mwenye anajikaa vibaya wewe unataka kutembea na mwanaume mwenye anajikaa siku hizi wanawake tumekataa hiyo mchezo hata kama unakaa ugly tutatafuta namna uende uko plastic surgery uende ute, utengenezwe uso ukae vizuri Wendo ngolewe meno ukai, ukai na meno smart. Wendo ufanyo vile uwa wanafanyanga huko. Ukue mhansa. We are, we are done with ugly men. We don't want. And then there is this, a good man is a man who respects and knows the value of a woman. Now, hapo ndo tunakuja. You know, for you to be a good man now, wachana na mambo ya richness and handsomeness. <laughs> now we are coming to ugly men. Ugly men in the house, yes. Eh, 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 for you to be a good man, there is no mandate here. You, as long as you are ugly, as long as you are handsome, you need to respect your woman. You need to know the value of a woman. Whether you are ugly, whether you are handsome, you need to know the value of a woman. Mubaba, unajua value ya mke wako? Leo naongelea wanaume, leo naongelea wababa, leo nikona nyinyi hapa na hapa. Have you, ever, have you ever sat down and be like, this is, I know the value of my wife. You know, for me, my mubaba knows my value. Eh? I know the value of my wife. I know her very well. I know her value. You know, when you value your women, automatically you will have a peaceful home. But if you don't value your woman, don't expect more than that. It is horrific, horrendous in that home. You know, when, 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 Wacha niwaambie nyinyi wanaume kitu moja. Kama unajua wewe ni msherati. Kabisa kabisa kabisa. Weka ndio unajua kuna wakati utashikwa. Lakini respect your woman. Unajua kuna wanaume hapa wenye wananitazama wanaweza pigia wa, mipango zao za kando wakiwa na mke wao kwa nyumba. Imagine. Kuna wengine hata wanaleta wao side chicks kwa nyumba anashurutisha mke wake aende alale sitting room, wao wakuje walale bedroom. Ama walale wote kwa kitanda. Do you know there are, men, there are women who are going through that? And this is a man. Alafu anambianga yesu wa sante jehova kwa kunilinda siku mzee. Mina kuambia utachoma na ile moto zaidi ya Sodoma na Gomora. Wanaume wa sherati ni sumu. Manyumba zao hazisimamangi. Mimi nikona, na, 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 nikona testimony. Mwanaume musherati hawawezi simamisha nyumba. Uongo. You'll be getting good wives and they'll be running away. Because usherati inamaliza ndoa completely. Usherati ni mbaya. Sana sana kwa wale wanawake wenye mipapa sikuka kwa ndoa. Haezi ka. Ataenda. So value your woman. Kuna wanaume hapa, wameenda, wamefanya, anafanya shopping marambili. Anajua tu vizuri. Kwa ke hakuna mtoto mchanga. Baati mbaya yule tela, anaeka pampa zapu. Wakati shopping inakuja kwa nyumba, mke is like, hey babe, pampas ulikuwa menunulia nani? And then anashuka sima, guy, kwani nilinunua pampas badala ya, ya wipes? Wipes za nani? Ati babe, sinizako, sinaunako kitumia wipes. Ah! Men, value your women. Just value your women. Hmm? Value your women. It's good to value your woman. Na mtaishi tu vizuri. Eh, mtaishi tu vizuri. So if you don't value your woman, remember there is no way you are going with your wife. Watu wanapatanga wanawake wazuri lakini, 
wanawatoka tu alafu mtu anakuja anaanza kusema woi woi hebu ona hebu ona tu chichi vile ana kasi hizi nilikosea wapi jamani mungu wangu nilikosea wapi huyu mwanamke akanitoka <laughs> kuna kuna wanaume wanaendanga hata kwa waganga wanaenda kwa waganga kuchunguza wake zao alafu mganga anaenda anakuambia uongo uongo <laughs> Anakwambia uongo 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 kuhusiana na mke wako unakuja unafuria mke wako unasema okay kama mke wangu anafanya hii maneno wacha mimi pia nijipa nijipange by the time it dawns on you like what did i do nilifanya nini jamani hmm? alafu you, alafu you are like mimi Mungu anisamehe tu eh hey! utavuna chenye ulipanda eh hey! Bila tu wanawake tunaendanga tunatafutanga tu mke mzee wangu anafanyanga nini kisiri? Kuna wanaume wenye wanaenda wanatafuta wake zao. Waombaji wanakwambia maneno 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 because ameona huyu mwanamke ako na future mzuri. Na because hakuna mtu mwenye anapendanga anapendeanga mwingine mazuri. Kwanza waombaji fake hawa. Wakiona tu mke wako ni mzuri na ni mke wako mwenye atakufungulia destinies, wanaharibu. But we usually tread in that path unknowingly. And then we lose that which we, 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 we really desire, like, this is my wife, you know. Akisha kutoka, you're like, no, unaza kujipigia kifua, this is my wife, this is my wife. I think you've heard that story, ya kwamba there is a man, uh, 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 there is a certain man, ya kwamba the wife was like, hey, mimi, mi na una mali tunailekezana, si mali pazuri. Wacha tutu wachani kwa uzuri, weenda zako, mine nde zangu, watoto tutasaidia na kulea. Mimi sio ni relationship kama inazidi because wewe ni msherati na mimi naona tunapigana sana juhu ya hii maneno. The man was like wacha nikwambie. Hmm? Kama you will you will not be mine then you will never be anybody else. You know that lady ended up being killed with this man. Story of my life. Why? Huo mwanamke alienda akaambiwa na mganga ya kwamba mume wako anafanya hivi na hivi na hivi. So huyu mama kakuja na kelele kwa nyumba wewe oh, unanipanga wewe oh, unanicheza wewe oh, sijui nini nini nini. So mzee was like, "Ai. Okay. Hii maneno yote unatoa wapi? Kuna wale wazee tu wazuri tu. Lakini wewe umeenda kwa mganga amekwambia, mchawi ameenda kukuonea mzee wako. Akakuonea. Imagine ndoa ikaharibika. So saa hizi unaangalia unapata mke wako amesonga, mume wako ameenda mbele. You're like, "Ai my god." Mi I miss this woman. Hata kama alikuanga mwenda wazimu kwa nyumba lakini ai huyu mama wachana naye. It is already too late. Sorry, value your women. Wenye mmeoana saa hizi value your women and respect so that hiyo ndoa yenye uko ndani isibomoke tena kama ya kwanza. <laughs> oh my god, may god help us. So that is the story that is trending. Okay? So value your women, know that a good man has to be rich and has to be very handsome. And despite it all, valuing the woman in their lives oh yes <laughs>